hey guys welcome back to another exciting tutorial of creating process and today we are starting our first episodes of our new series of graphic design in this series we'll be looking at the principle theory and concepts involved behind graphic design each week we'll be selecting a topic and we'll create our bundles of graphic design related to that topic the design may include posters cards pamphlets magazine covers magazines and lots of other stuff so this week we have World Cancer Awareness Day. So for this day, we'll be creating out few graphic designs so that you can share it and spread this awareness everywhere. So our first design includes some graphical elements combined together. So uh, let's create out that stuff. So I'll use the ellipse tool and create out the first element uh, with the ellipse tool. I'll create a circle. Now I'll just uh, duplicate this control c control f and just with the all press just scale it down now select these two and with the shape builder tool we'll give some different color one different here and different there now let's bring this one okay select that now i'll do is i'll bring out some uh, color reference so i got an image for the awareness day and each month uh, we have lots of awareness for cancers and if this month we have some few uh, cancer awareness uh, like this so we'll use this color as a reference so i'll just place it around here and let's work out with this color so first of all i'll just uh, bring out this color reference so i'll just use the rectangle and place here one rectangle duplicate it this one with the eye picker i just select this color from here so uh, we need this color b select this with the eye picker select dark color now that's all I'll just delete this out and let's use this color to fill up with our uh, this design so this one will fill this up with these next we need to create our uh, four three more uh, elements so will you start with the again with the ellipse tool and draw the ellipse well, I'll fill this up with this black color I'll just duplicate this control C control F and uh, scale it down till this much I'll use the rotate tool and set the center point around here and with the alt and shift press just click and drag now control D to duplicate it this much now I'll create one more so I'll use the rounded rectangle tool and create out a rounded rectangle tool here rounded rectangle and what I'll do is I'll do the same stuff next design is uh, we need to uh, create a heart so I'll use the ellipse tool and create out a first circle then let's fill this up with certain color uh, with the eye picker choose color from here V and now uh, we'll break this point so with the anchor point tool just break a point here and one around here like that next thing we need to create is under one so i use the ellipse tool and create out a ellipse circle fill it up with some normal color and duplicate it with a shift and or pressed and uh, keep it attached to each other like this duplicate it one more and drag it down and make sure to place it around here like this now let's scale this down so with the alt and shift press just scale it down till this much now next thing we need to do is we need to use the line segment and draw the line line from this point and attaching to this point uh, let's give it some stroke color let's give, uh, make it black in the same way from here also attached uh, from this
let's create a grid first so I'll uh, use a rectangle tool and create out a rectangle select the rectangle go to uh, object path split into grid and we'll divide this into uh, 4 by 4 let's preview it okay let's keep it around here for a while and first first one I'll select this and with the, uh, fill it up with the white color and this one I'll just uh, go in there okay that's looking good uh, Control G and just place it around here check it out that's looking good now let's duplicate this Now select everything and group this up Control G and I'll just tilt this up to 45 degree angle like this or maybe you can just give different angle it's your ways and now bring this to here now next thing create a rectangle on the top of that so from here just draw the rectangle till this much and select everything and make clipping marks. So if you look at it, it's looking good. We can uh, do some adjustments like this and go to transparency here where the opacity is 100. Let's reduce it to 40 and you can see the change here it's looking great so uh, this is the first uh, graphic design for this I uh, will work on the other one our next design is the poster so we're we'll going to the Photoshop and create out that design so I open the Photoshop file empty file and I got a reference uh, image for my uh, design so I got this from the internet and I'll be using this as a reference uh, to create out my design so I just uh, had it uh, to the layer now I'll bring in some of the stuffs first of all I'll just uh, change the color to blue so I'll change it to with the RP card select this color and selecting this layer our all backspace uh, to fill it the color next I'll bring in the layers I got this hand the scale this up and place it here like this enter and the same way I'll bring in on uh, the other this one the earth so once your image is imported uh, click enter I will do the masking here so we'll do it first of all select that now to do the masking I'll use this selection tool and with a shift and all press draw a circle and with the space bar pressed you can move the the selection area so I'll just use the space bar So once you have done that, uh, we'll do the masking. Selecting this layer, I click on this mask and everything is masked out. Like this, we got this earth. Now what I'll do is select this, control D. I'll just scale it down, call it to size. And let's drag it down to this uh, layer now. And I'll mask off a few of the stuff like uh, I need this glow on the hand so I don't uh, this portion is not going to be visible so I'll mask off that and so to do the masking I'll use the pen tool so draw use the, the pen tool just draw the uh, shape according to the hand glow so that you can uh, uh, mask off this unwanted pieces or this unwanted hand parts
So after drying out this uh, uh, boundary with the pen tool, I'll uh, make convert this into shape, and a new layer is formed. And after that, I just uh, click with the Alt uh, with the Control press. Just click on this layer, and you got the selection area. So just hide this for a while and select this layer. And after selecting this layer, click on the uh, mask option. And here you can see it has been masked, but uh, we need the opposite one. So uh, with the Control and I pressed, you can invert the selection area like this. Now you can see we got that nice effect here. Uh, here it feels like it's holding the holding this earth and just because of this masking and you got this nice effect now let's do the placement with this uh Choose the color, dark color, with the picker from here, and with the brush tool, with the opacity, keeping minimum, let's just draw it. And we'll keep this multiply and add it like this, slowly add it, and you got this nice uh, uh, shadows here, so we'll make sure to click this and we'll work under this inside this only so Finally, in this video of graphic design, we have completed two projects, each has its unique feature. If you want to check out the complete video tutorial of these two projects, uh, I'll be sharing the link very soon. The two designs is available for download absolutely free, so download it, share it and spread the awareness. Please share your views in the comment below uh, on how you feel about this new series and what else are you expecting from this series of graphic design. Uh, leave the comment below. Uh, if you like this video, click the thumbs up button. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Don't forget to check out the next tutorial coming up. I mean, if you want more of this designing, you can press the subscribe button. Thank you.